Yo, what's going on YouTube? It's your boy Lex Thomas 21 and I'm back with Batman the Telltale Series Episode 2. I know I'm late to the party with uploading this gameplay, but I had no internet, I had no way to upload the gameplay, I had no way to download the gameplay, so let's go ahead and get into this, the first this Episode 2 called The Pact. We're going to get introduced to some interesting villains in Batman's Rogue Gallery. So let's get into this, man. Let's get it. Let's go. Please slap the like button. Please subscribe for more. Let's get into this. Let's get it. Let's go. A madman from Gotham's past returned to terrorize my city. He drew me into his twisted game, striking at the things I hold most dear. But I survived his deadly traps. I emerged the victor. But the cost was too great. Lucius Fox is dead. Riddler is dead. And with him, the only lead I had to taking down the greatest danger Gotham has ever faced. And the person best equipped to help me is a threat to my deepest secret. The Riddler was going to be my way in once we captured him alive. But now I have you to lean on. A man who lives on both sides of the line and knows exactly when to cross it. Yes, you and I will be working together very closely. Bruce Wayne. First thing you need to know, I can keep your secret. And since you've been doing right by me, I'll continue to keep it. No reports, nothing. No one else needs to know. To deal with the present threat, though, I need both of you. The man inside and outside the mask. You have to understand, I'm not the enemy here. It may seem that way right now, but I'm not. Our problems are far too big for us to be bickering among ourselves. You shouldn't see me as an adversary. You don't have to tell me that. I know we're on the same side. I'm glad to hear it. <laughs> I thought you might be harder to convince. When Riddler's friends hear he's dead, they ain't gonna just carry on carrying on. They might get sloppy. They might want revenge. Or they might simply accelerate their plans. I'm gonna need eyes everywhere in Gotham. A man like Bruce Wayne, with all his influence and resources, can go places Batman can't. You understand what I'm saying, don't you? Your public persona could be a great help to us here. Maybe even as much as Batman in certain situations. I know when to be Batman and when to be Bruce. It's the mask that fits best at the time. Tactical. Now you're speaking my language. What the oh. hell? Looks like the whole city's under attack. We've got a report of a raid on the Gotham PD arsenal. If those bastards get their hands on our weapons... This is coordinated. It's Riddler's gang. It has to be. We're gonna need Batman for this one. Agreed. Emergency services is already pushed to the limit. Yeah, then we'll have to redeploy patrol officers to defend the arsenal. Don't divert any men, Gordon. I can handle the arsenal call. Then go already. Let's move, people. This is what we train for. There's been an attack in the financial district. Biotech company on the west side is under siege. All right, what I'm going to do is I'm going to probably just, like, when I'm talking to Wilder be on her side, but I'm going to still try to be friends with Jim Gordon. That's probably what I'll do, because Jim Gordon is always going to be yo, yo dude. So be 
You can't trust Wilder, man. She got some sick um, thoughts, so we're gonna try to, you know, keep on her good side at some points, but we can't call Jim. We're gonna call Jim. you came for. You don't need me. Well, you better hope that's not true. I'll live your usefulness and the boss will make a pretzel out of your neck. I didn't want to, I swear. It's okay. Get out of here. Now. Thank you, Batman. Hey, you about done? Yeah, yeah. Just... I'ma drop him, bub. Let's go ahead and do this. We gotta be epic. We Batman, we gotta be epic. It's time to be epic. Son. What? Come on, son. What do you think this is? You about to be ruthless. You're getting shot. Get shot, bruh. Let's go. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Who are you? A nightmare. Much like yourself. But you can call me Bane. Win a war alone. You fight well, but you fight alone, you will die alone. See why Riddler wanted to be the one to kill you. Riddler is dead. He's dead, Riddler? You should be worrying about yourself. I promised my men a hell of a battle if ever I faced you. And I'd hate to disappoint them. Oh, I haven't faced a true warrior since I left Peña Duro prison. <laughs> feeling but <laughs> Mm-hmm. <gasps> 
nothing to fear, my friend. <laughs> Keep your eyes open. Don't let anyone follow you to the warehouse. Don't worry, we'll take the back way by the docks. Safe travels, my friend. Batman! Batman! Then say something if you can hear me! Gordon... Christ... Batman... Come on, help me! It won't move! Batman, we're gonna need you to help us push this thing off you. Come on! You can do it! It's moving! Jesus Christ. Come on. The mechanic. Where is he? He didn't make it. Damn it. He saved my life. Batman? It's okay, Jim. They just need a minute. The entire GCPD arsenal raided? Every single armored personnel carrier stolen? With those and the hardware they stole? Christ, I didn't want to think about it. I just want to know who these sons of bitches are. There's only one of them that matters. He called himself Bane. His men loaded the weapons onto the APCs, said they were taking them to a warehouse near the docks. They need to be found. I'm already taking orders from Waller. Well, I gotta take it from you, too? So that's how it is. I'm sorry, Jim. But the city will be in danger if you don't. I'll, uh, see what I can do. Put whatever manpower we can spare on the search for those armored vehicles. In the field and watching CCTV feeds. Yes, sir. You know, I'm still mad as hell at you. What for? Beating that Riddler goon half to death. I only agreed to work with you because I thought you were a man of principle. Someone who wanted to step out of the shadows and into the light. I don't know what's going on with you and Waller, but you've changed. It's like I don't even know who you are anymore. Waller, she has something on me. Jesus, Batman, what? No, wait, tell me later. I've already got enough to worry about. I'm glad you called me with this. Good to know this partnership still means something. But I won't lie, we've still got a ways to go. <sighs> right on time. I'll get to the Batcave. See if I can make some sense of what happened tonight. 
So, what did I miss? Oh, I was at the scene of a heist at the Gotham brokerage house when Batman called me here. What were they after? We're still getting a full account. Once the dust settles, I'll send you everything we've got. Detective Bullock's writing up a full report. I'll have him send you a copy. Officers are ready for your deployment orders. I've got to get going. Your partner, Vesta. How is she? Still in the hospital. The doctors say the hearing damage could be permanent. Damn it, it should have been me. I failed her. I put her in danger. It's my fault. Hold on to that anger. You'll need it. Avesta says anger can be productive if you put it to good use. She's right. Look, I owe you one for saving my life back there. So I gotta warn you. Waller flipped when she heard you called Gordon instead of her. You really should stay on Waller's good side for as long as you can. For everyone's sake. I'll tell Avesta you asked about her. Alfred, prep the med bay. We're going to need it. Yeah, this episode's not gonna end well, because Batman is pretty hurt, so let's see how this episode ends, yo.